Holy cow, what a year. I mean, yeah, what a year. Hey, <laughs> it's Regina from Courageously Free. Some of you know, some of you might not know, but Mike and I had a baby. And at the end of December 2016, we um, came back to New Zealand to settle down. Those of you who are parents may know that, yeah, feeding takes up a lot of time. So I had a lot of time to think and reflect back on the past three years. And that's part of the reason why I'm doing this video is because I wanted to let you know what we'll be doing moving forward because it's actually, yeah, it's quite interesting. I had a lot of time to reflect on the past few years thinking about the workshops and the webinars and all that kind of stuff, the people that we've taught about social media marketing around your business. And obviously we think it's super important. But what was, make, what was making me a little bit sad was that I didn't see the longevity in a lot of the businesses or some of the people that we've helped over the years. And I was thinking, okay, how the heck can we help people create more longevity? I mean, yeah, we can teach you Facebook marketing and blogging and Instagram and all this stuff, you know, through webinars, workshops, whatever. But what is that one missing piece that people usually forget? And that is really creating a strategy around your content. And it's really not unlike having a business plan. You know, you need that plan to think about how you're going to operate your business. In this case, how to create your content, what to create your content around, your reason why, blah, 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 blah. Um, and so as I was for the many, many hours I've been feeding, I came up with a simple model around a content marketing strategy. So that's why I'm here. And I just wanted to let you know that over the next few emails, over the next few weeks, I'm going to be talking a bit about what content a content marketing strategy is, what content marketing is versus social media. Are they the same or are they different? And how can you use them how can you use content marketing specifically for your business in a really efficient way? So, hey, okay, here's my here's my one my one minute elevator speech. Are you ready? This is what I've been using in my in my networking groups, and it's kind of embarrassing, but I'm going to do it anyway. So, um, you know, oftentimes you'll put a post up there on your Facebook um, your, your Facebook business page or your blog or whatever. And you hope and you pray that someone is going to bite that bait and buy your product or service, right? Well, really doing that, you're kind of wasting your time and your money. If you knew how to be able to create a plan towards making profit online through your online presence. And if you knew that that would save time and money in the end, would you? <laughs> Anyways, so that's, <laughs> that's my part of my elevator speech and really what we're doing moving forward is helping you collect, curate, and connect through your content marketing strategy and that is collect ideas and information about your goals, your mission, and your why. Curate data into tangible information through media so that you can connect to your audience by giving them exactly what they're looking for. How did I do? <laughs> Keep your eye open on your inbox, open the next few emails because I'm gonna be sending you information on the differences between content marketing and social media marketing. Well, are they the same? Are they different? We'll be talking about the simple model that I've been building so that you can follow it too. And in fact, I'm gonna be having webinars moving forward. So it'd be cool if you were on there because the first few webinars are gonna be free just so that you can get some information. Those of you who are going to be on the webinar will have free access to our membership site. So keep your eyes open, and it's great to be back. And I'll see you soon. Bye. Need a content marketing strategy? Message me if you like. I'll tell you how you can get a free 15-minute consultation.